Today in InDesign, we are going to be taking a look at how to wrap text around objects and images to make more interesting compositions. The first thing to do is grab your text tool and drag out a text box. Then place in your body copy. I will be pasting in gibberish lorem ipsum text. After that, we need to create an object to wrap our text around. So you can either create the shape with one of the default tools or create a custom shape with the pen tool. I will just be dragging out a simple ellipse. Now if we drag our shape over our text, we can see that nothing happens. To make the text wrap around our object, we need to first go up to Window, and then go down to Text Wrap, and also make sure that you have your shape selected. In this window, you will see that the first option, called No Text Wrap, is checked by default. Now if you select the next option over, the text will then wrap around the bounding box of the shape. This is again, the blue box that goes around our circle. Now to get it to wrap around the shape of the object itself, select the next option over that says Wrap Around Object Shape. Now the next two options will only be acceptable if you have two text boxes linked together. Now if I grab my selection tool and click the red plus on my text box, which indicates that I have more text that is not shown, and then drag out another box, I can then use those options. Now the first of the two options will split the text and cause it to jump over the object. The second will cut off all of the text below the object and push it into the start of the next column. Now if we switch back to our shape wrap, we also have options for adjusting the offset around the shape on each side. You can also select different wrap options for various results. Lastly, you can also use text wrap with images. So first go up to File, and then down to Place, and select your image. Then drag out the size you would like your image to be. Now keep in mind that PNG formats work best because they contain transparency data and can allow for wrapping around the contents of the image instead of just the border. Now once you have your image on top of the text, go ahead and select the shape wrap option and then adjust the contour options to affect how the text wraps around the image. For this PNG I recommend using the alpha channel option so that it takes advantage of the PNG file type. So there you have it, now you can wrap text around anything you want in InDesign. So as always, if you enjoyed this InDesign tutorial, be sure to subscribe, rate, comment, and share it with your friends.